we've never had a fire this destructive here. They've always seemed to be, you know, if, if you lose a building, it was an outbuilding. And we counted just on Quail Canyon Road, we counted 15 residences plus, plus outbuildings. So that's, uh, that were completely burned to the foundation. And Pleasance Valley Road is a lot worse from what I've seen so far. Yeah, it's, it's an ugly mess. I drove the pickup first and then she followed me. I had the dogs in, in with me and he had a hose and was hosing off stuff as we left, so. Yeah, I stayed and did this, did the stupid thing. But it, the, you know, for me, the wind, the wind was pretty favorable or changed and it was very favorable and it, it went, started moving south and then it, you know, I, I hear it took out a lot of, you know, a lot of houses all the way down to 80. So there's a uh, wind that precedes a fire. It's, it's quite different than any other kind of wind. And I only experienced it twice, once in paradise and once the other night, where it's, 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 a, it's a whirling, strange kind of a feeling that you get in the air. My dad um, lived in paradise and he and my wife took off last two, what, two nights ago now. And they got down the bottom of the driveway and they both, they both were driving separate cars. They both hit horses. And my dad's truck is right down here on the road, mashed in, you'll see it. They did that on their exit because it was just like leaving paradise. They had flames going across the road and anyway, crazy. No, I was living alone at the time. And uh, yeah, there was nothing left in paradise then for me and, and I had an opportunity to come down here and live so that's what I did.